here with head coach Shannon Levichuk after an amazing game against Stanford um, at the American East Championship today. Coach, if you could just start with your overall thoughts on today's performance. I mean, I thought, honestly, we played our best field hockey game we've played in four years. Um, we absolutely saved our best for last, and we came up short. I, I think we elongate that game 10 more minutes. We, we certainly have the opportunity to tie it up, but obviously the game's only 70 minutes, and um, we had our opportunities, but overall, I just couldn't be more proud of how this team competed today. Coach, looking at the first half, the team came right out of the gate attacking, scoring first, um, and goes into halftime tied at 2-2. Uh, if you could just walk us through that first half a little bit. Yeah, I thought the first half, they, they probably came out with some momentum, a little uh, pre-tournament or ner tournament nerves for us, obviously being first time uh, tournament attendees, but I thought we worked those nerves out pretty quickly within the first 10 minutes and started gaining some possession of the ball. And for us to come down on a fast break and score uh, to set the tone of the game, I thought really changed our energy level and kept that first half back and forth. Second half, the teams were deadlocked for almost the entire thing, coming down to the very last minute. Um, what was the difference in the second half? I think both teams brought their energy level up. They knew they were going to have to compete hard. I think we brought that Lowell fighter mentality um, throughout the game, and I think that maybe stunned Stanford a little bit. Um, we talked a lot about our preparation of pride and competing, and I couldn't be more proud of their efforts in attaining those two goals. Um, obviously, us you know, competing and keeping that at 2-2 for nearly the entire game just speaks volumes um, to our preparation, um, which obviously a lot of credit goes to my associates head coach and my assistant coaches who have really really did a great job preparing them for what Stanford was going to bring and I think that was the difference and I I, I guess I'm a little bit um, I don't I don't have a lot of words because I'm, I'm stunned that the game that was just played um, happened but stunned in such a, a happy and amazing way because I didn't know this team had it in them. I mean, I hope that they did, and maybe I did know, but to bring it out this last game and compete and represent our conference um, as the number four seed in our university against Stanford just speaks volumes to the character of this team. Um, and I'm just really, I, I mean, I'm gonna continue to use the word proud, but I am, I am the proudest coach today. And lastly, Coach, um, this history-making year ends here at the American East Championship, the team's first time ever here. Um, what was your message to the team after this game? I think we just talked about how they will go down in history as being the first women's team to make an American East tournament, but more importantly, in our field hockey program, which has been very successful over the past 15 years, that they will have been part of one of the best field hockey games, if not the best field hockey game um, that this program has ever played. So for these 24 young women who have put everything on the line this season and for the seniors for the past four years, um, it's just nothing short of amazing what they did today. So although we came off on the, uh, on the on the losing end I think we won in so many ways and it just speaks to where we're going um, next year and in, in the seasons to come so um, I, I spoke to them about being proud of their efforts and, and how they represented themselves their university and really um, in my mind and in their minds they won today Thanks,